okay with the events that are unfolding currently. <clears throat> Thanks, Green. Do you consider Donald Trump to be a political rival of President Biden? I I'm not going to speak to that first. Yeah, well, I'm pissed, and it feels like your fault. Talk about Trump all the time. So, do you consider him to be? Eh, a I don't talk about Trump all the time. I'm sorry, could you speak into my good ear? From MAGA, you guys were criticizing his handling of COVID last week. Yeah. You've mentioned his January 6th response a couple days and, ago. No. So can you say, based on all that, I, I didn't say anything about Mar-a-Lago, I'm just saying. No. Consider the president I'm, to be I'm saying from here, I'm not gonna comment on that. Obviously. Obviously, right? Silly me. I want to uh, think that he would be very fortunate to run against Trump in 2024, like he had said before. Again, I'm not going to comment it's on just, it's just I'm not. <laughs> Enough of this rowdy, rebel, sneaking behavior. In the next election, I'd be very fortunate if I had that same man running against me. Does he still All I can that? tell you, Peter, is that the president intends to run in 2020. I can't, I can't, I can't say that word. Jesus, you got a one track mind. It's always politics, politics, politics. Is there a concern here that if you guys don't say more, then these Republicans who are accusing this White House of weaponizing the Justice Department, weaponizing the FBI, <laughs> are, that's going to become the, the public sentiment. If you guys don't say once and for all, we are not doing that. First, first of all, we're just not going to comment on the Department of